Hello and welcome back to Here We Tow. So today I'm at the launch of the Adria Caravans and Motorhomes for 2022. And in this vlog, I'm going to be taking a first look at this. It's the new Adria Sonic 700, and this is the DC layout. There's going to be three layouts all together, DC, SL and DL. So what do we need to know about it? Well, previously on Sonic, we had the 710 and the 810, but for 2022, we're only going to be having the Sonic 700 Supreme. There'll be no 800 series, so it's only single axle, and prices are going to start at around £97,000. MTPLM is going to be coming in at 4,400 kilos, so you are going to need your C1 driver's license, but you are going to be getting a payload of probably around 1,100 kilos. So let's start at the front. It's an A-class motorhome, or known as Integrated. It's got that great big windscreen, those lovely mirrors. It's on the Fiat Ducato. You're going to be getting 180 brake horsepower. I don't know whether it's available in manual, but there's certainly an automatic transmission, nine speed. Down the offside, we see we've got the uh, one piece here. The cab door is actually on the near side or passenger side. This is left-hand drive just for the launch today. We've got that great big two-lay wind-out canopy there. We've got the electric step. The vents for the fridge freezer, we've got the nice alloy wheels. And then back here, we come to the garage. Now this is amazing. If you are wanting to use that huge payload, then you'll even be able to get something like a small motorbike or scooter in there, as long as you don't overload that back axle, but absolutely huge. There's a vent here as part of the Alderwet central heating. The bed does raise and lower, so you've got more storage in the garage if needed. It's currently at its highest setting right now, as far as I know, so it shows the garage at its best. This here is an external cold and warm water shower. That's to operate the bed, and then we've got a socket and the 10 amp. That's the garage. Now around the back, this is where it's all going on. We have got a new back end on the Adria Sonic. So look at that, we've got the black bumper down here with the uh, reversing sensors that we can just see. And then we've got the new light cluster and this is what's new. You can see it goes all the way across here. And as we go up, it's got the big silver back and the new style reversing camera, which um, hopefully will be a little bit better than the, than the one on my 2021 model, which is an old style. Uh, and I've not been massively impressed. So hopefully that'll be a huge improvement. Coming down the near side, we've got most of our utilities here. We can see diesel, AdBlue, water, the Alda there, toilet cassette. So it's nice to see them here on this near side. Then we've got the cab door. We'll just open this. This would normally lead into the passenger seat, but as I say, on this one, it's a driver's because it's come over from Slovenia for the launch, but a good size cab door. And then as we head round, we'll go look inside because I think that's what we all want to see. So here we come round, we've got the electric step. We'll open up this really nice wide door. We've got a bin in it, as we can see, and then we'll step in. So we've got the Alderwet central heating. We've got the leather. Now this is available in cream and black. Um, I think it may, I'm not sure if it's still an, an option that you have to pay for, but this is the DC model. So D stands for Dianette. So that gives you these two lounge seats. We've got the table, this folds, just do that. So you can see there, really good size table. And then up in the cab, we've got the new model Fiat, which has got the big infotainment system there with the which will be sat nav as well and the digital dash there and if i just step back so we've got the two swivel chairs we've got these nice lounge seats here and then above we have a drop down electric bed so we don't get the sunroof there but we do have a hecky light there there's two little storage cupboards I've got one there and then one on this near side, we'll open that. And then we've got a bigger one here over the kitchen area. So that gives you an idea 
about the cupboard space. I do like this dark wood finish. I was never a fan of dark wood, but yeah, it's sort of grown on me a bit. But yeah, dark wood. And then we're going into the kitchen area. So the kitchen, I'd say the workshop space is limited, if I'm being honest. Uh, we've got a square sink. We've got three gas burners. Adria don't do electric, so three gas. Never been a problem for me personally. And we've got room for a little coffee machine up here, look. And then we've got two plug sockets and the extractor and some lighting. And as we come down, we've got the Thetford gas oven and grill. And then we've got these nice drawers. Now, what I like about these is the little handles are flush, but then they pop out. And you can see the width there, absolutely huge. So there's three of those. Over on the off side, where we've come in through the big wide door, we're then going to find control panel for the Adria. You'll be able to have the Adria Mac. We've got the Alder Wet Central Heating. We've got the controls just under here for the drop down bed. We've got an aerial socket. We've got a bracket for the TV and lighting and electric step controls and these little uh, compartments. Huge Thetford Tower Fridge Freezer. That's very good. I really like these Thetford Tower Fridge Freezers. That runs on gas and electric. The storage, that's a huge cupboard up there. And then we're going to venture back into the mid washroom. So over on the off side, we're going to find the shower cubicle. So we've got a nice um, hecky above for ventilation, good size shower head. The shower, now it's quite narrow. I'll start down here. It's quite narrow down here, as you can see. That was the first thing I noticed about it. But once you step in, you do get this bit here so it does widen up so once you're in the shower you've actually got all this room here so it is more just the the lower end that's a little bit more restricted i'll just turn around because the door opens this way on the washroom so i'll open the washroom door so that's now closed off the living space if you can see that there and this is the washroom now i really like this we've got i'll just open this up we've got space there for toiletries not massively deep on the, the shelves there then we've got fruit bowl sink but we've got a really good cupboard space under here that makes up for that uh, other one there as i say fruit bowl the good thing is is this this mirror is flush and there's some nice little um spotlights just above it as well so it doesn't impede when you're trying to use the the sink um so that's nice then we've got the Thetford toilet and the one thing I can't see is a toilet roll holder so yeah not sure where you're going to put that close that up now back into the bedroom there is a door uh, just here to my right which I'll pull across so you have got a privacy door on a night time very solid big solid door this is the DC so it's a central island bed it is massive that must be about five feet wide and six foot five long maybe i don't know it's absolutely huge there's a little bit of storage under it you can see it's currently right up because you can see this this is because it's fully raised so if you're worrying about how you're going to get into it you can lower this bed now it doesn't appear that i can retract it i don't know whether it does or not i'd have to have a, a bit of a closer look at it and i haven't managed to do that but um, at the moment it's obviously fully out and it's a very big bed we've got wardrobes and storage above underneath there's um that there is the adria sound system controller there's a speaker that will illuminate unfortunately i'm not connected to power but that would illuminate i would imagine and then we've got these usbs here and light switches and i do like this shelving it's great for putting cups of tea and bits and pieces on so i'll just move around because show you the other side now one thing i've noticed is because the bed's so long there's not a lot of room here so hopefully this bed does retract if not you'll have to squeeze around i'm a size eight and i'm struggling to get around there right more usbs there and obviously I'll just step up here there we go it's just some cushions in it at the moment but good size wardrobes right 
just move around. Over on that offside there, we've got an aerial, so you could fit a bracket there to watch television. And if we look back out into the Sonic, it just gives you an idea out through there. So let's venture back out. I'll just work my way around the bed. There we go. And that's the lounge area again. Right. Normally I finish the vlogs outside, but the heavens have opened, so I won't be doing that. So there we go. That is the new Adria Sonic uh, 700, which is the new series now for 2022. Um, prices start from around £97,000. This is their top end A-class motorhome. They are a beautiful motorhome. They are my favourite. Hopefully you've enjoyed having just a first look at this today. It's not been in detail. It's just to give you an idea. So as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.